Hi, my boys. Today is um, July 9th, 6.01, Tuesday, 2024. Um, last night I went walking. I went walking and um, crossing the street. And as I was about to hit the curb, I got shocked. <laughs> kind of felt like pebbles, like hit me, or kind of felt like okay. What I can what I can describe it, because a lot of people have never got or had haven't had like electrocuted, so I've gotten electrocuted before. And it feels just like that, like it pops, something pops, and um, if you hold it long enough, you feel like a popping sensation. Um, so, I don't know, anyways, I've gotten electrocuted before, so that's what I've, I've, I've experienced with uh, a feeling. Um... And I've had an incident where a pole, a, a light, a, um, a power line, um, it gives off warnings and I felt, uh, like a energy surge or whatever it was, but my, my hairs, all my hair started standing up on me and, it, um, a big wave hit me and then I, I heard like it sound like um, a trumpet like uh, something and then it blew so I felt something happened before that so I know that something like that I'm rambling but I'm trying to figure out what this shit was last night I'm walking and it felt like either I got stabbed real quick on my arm, like right here, um, like on my side, like the under part, and then and there were like my rib cage a little bit. It felt like pebble, like like a BB gun, not a BB, like Orbeez, like hitting you, like like that, or someone just like stabbing you, kind of. But if you don't realize what it is, it kind of just feels weird. But I'm trying to relate to it. So I'm like, what is that? What is that? And I felt all last night, warning, warning, warning. They're going to kill you. They're going to kill you. And I'm, like, I'm trying to, like, I'm aware. I'm aware of it. I'm aware of it. Like, I understand. I'm so tired. I'm so drained. But yet I have energy. Anyway, uh, but the, the, the thing is that it lingered. It kind of lingered and it just went away. It was just like, pay attention. And I was clumsy yesterday. Um, I had people just like, kind of just I don't know it was just an odd day yesterday and I was barely out I was only out for like maybe an hour yesterday I just didn't want to be outside I just couldn't be outside so I just stayed at home and cleaned up organized made a mess to organize again I don't know I made a mess again Oh, I forgot the paper. It doesn't matter. The court paper. I printed out extra court paper so I can go and mail it. I forgot those. They're already on top of the printer, already ready to go, but. Anyways, um. 
meditating. And I felt like I was going to pass out yesterday. And I'm like, this is it. This is it. Man, when I went, when I was working at Sears, and I hit my head on the freaking beam, the metal beam, it hurt so bad. It feels like that. Like, um, you just know when you pass out, you start like glaring or you start getting a. I think they say an aura or a premonition or something. So that's why I got tested for seizures. Lights don't bother me. I'm fine with lights. So I'm like, it can't be seizures. Can't. It has to be something else. I don't know, but... Anthony, when Anthony, when my son Anthony was born, um, to me it was a miracle. No one wanted him alive. It seemed like. to my ancestors and I certainly um, yeah that Lincoln that Kennedy <laughs> bacon oh my god So, anyways, uh, my calling. Um, I, I, I knew I had a problem with men because of my dad and my mom. I totally knew that. And that's why I wished for you boys. So my calling, uh, I've always talked to you. I talked to you and uh, I walked with you and I want you to remember those conversations. But you were, you were watching and I was like telling your dad, I told your dad everything about you boys. And it's like, one ear out the other, it seemed like. Because obviously he's not paying attention to you boys. I miss you so much, Colin. Um, I wish for you boys. So that means when I'm no longer here, you are going to have a lot of hard times. Because people didn't want me here. So you're going to feel that tug of war. You're going to feel that fight. And um, you know how the schools are. You know how they were treating you. It's not how I, I want my son to be treated. So um, you have ancestors behind you. And to take your own life to commit suicide, um, is a, is very hard. It's a tough, do it for all the right reasons. Cause I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here without you boys. I wish for you boys to be here in my life to help me. My dad, Papa, saying, you have powers, you have powers, tell them. 
Kinda sounds weird, but yeah. You have some gifts that the other people have forgotten over the over over centuries. So don't let anyone experiment on you. Don't let anyone take you for granted. Um, live your life. And don't regret things. Do things. Think, think, think about it. Because words do definitely hurt. Uh, but actions. You can say the stupidest shit. I say the stupidest shit. But um, if you need help, I'll be there. You know? I have to be there for myself. And I am. Um, I have always done the mirror image thing, Colin. So I know that that's going to become, that's going to come good for you. Like, it's going to help you find who you are and um, to use your gifts, your powers, your superpowers. Um, tune in to your surroundings and when you meditate you can move things your vibrations just move things I will always always be with you my calling always you so much uh, I didn't tell you purposely about certain things I would be doing like the witchcraft stuff and the medium psychic. Anthony really, I don't know, I just didn't feel like Anthony understood it. Like he just, he just grew up with it. I just felt like, I don't know, I wasn't going to push him. He saw too much. I just knew he was heavily protected. Um, Joseph. Your brother is like your biggest fan. He tells me. It's hard losing a baby. No matter what stage it is. Because you have all those hopes and dreams and... Yeah. But... Since I already knew... That there's an afterlife. Crying and crying is just a waste of time.
it's unbelievable how many people of God just I'll get gas. I'll commit my I'll commit my next crime. But first let me fill up. Let me get gas first. And then commit more crimes. I don't know. I hate my mother. I don't want you boys to have this hate. I'm almost the same age as my mom when I had you, Anthony. <laughs> my mom never did this shit at all with me. What makes things worse is that her whole family knew. They just want her to shut up. My Aunt Bonnie's disgusting. But her grandkids are gonna know how awful of a woman she truly is. The children, the next generation children are going to know how horrible these these people of God truly are. And I promise that on my grandmother's grave, my grand grandmother's grave. <laughs> and as I took a picture while standing on her grave, my boys, I see that cross behind me on my shoulder. And I remember that they said that the Pope, I think that was the one on the Dodger Stadium. And the Pope went to bless it or something and it's there. My dad's like, he told me to put on the Sailor Moon song. I'm like, oh yeah, I remember that show. So I put on the Sailor Moon song and I'm like, oh my gosh. I just don't want to be here. I'm getting trolled online. When I go outside, it's like... People are God. raping people for money. I can't, I can't. I'm going home. I have to celebrate. I just said death was quick. I can handle pain. Let me die. I 
and I will not be with Pope. I will not be with God. I will not be with Jesus. I'm going to be with Hermes flying around. Which is crazy because, like, how do I like the whole like angel, the wing thing? But I'm like, how does humans have wings? Because Hermes don't got, Hermes has shoe wings. I mean, or no wings at all. I don't know. Yeah, Indian time. It's 24-7. <laughs> That's funny. I'll see you boys in a bit. Love you and just rambling because uh, just like those tarot readers, those tarot cards, these videos are going to help you later on. Just when you need it. And they'd be like, oh, stupid mom. I don't know. I don't know. I just know that um, I need you boys in my life. Always. I'm forgetting. Because I have no pictures, I do not look at your stuff because I can't. Desi, I watch your things. It's not enough. Even if I were to have you boys, I need to prepare you boys for my death. only fair. I love you boys and I'll see you boys in a bit.